Hey guys, it's Mike again. Um, this is the second episode of Mike P's Tees and Such. Uh, really sucks because I had a 40 minute video of all the animals feeding and they all ate and we got great shots and it turns out something went crazy with the storage on my phone and I couldn't figure it out so I had to restart my entire phone and was not able to post that video so I'm probably gonna end up looking into working on getting a camera and just using mini SD cards to record on that camera and then upload from my phone I don't have a computer I do plan on getting one in the future but that won't be for a while um, so I also wanted to explain a little bit more about how my channel will go uh, there will probably be times where most people will consider it boring um, I am mainly just taking footage of what I normally do I, I feed these animals twice a week uh, probably only be posting videos once a week unless something cool or crazy happens um, rehouses I'll do videos on uh, obviously Sundays will always be videos because Sunday is the feeding day where I feed all of my animals I do not have enough animals to where I feel like I can justify feeding three slings that are just really out and quick I may be wrong if you guys would like to see the shorter videos then I can upload on Wednesdays as well um, as long as my phone will allow me to do what I need it to do um, so that's pretty much how my show will be going um, trying to think am I leaving anything else out oh yes most of my videos will be like this where I say I'm um, a lot because I am not tech savvy I do not know how to uh, cut my videos down make them shorter and that's something that I'll have to work on um, this will be a grow as I go I'm not an expert that is another reason people might find it boring um, yes I do like to post the videos of them uh, with their feeding responses obviously but as far as it being super action-packed it's probably not gonna be that way um, there might even be times where the camera's out of focus and I have no idea and we don't get to see what we want to see um, so yeah it does really suck about the video because that was the only thing I did today uh, so instead of getting individual shots of all of the animals I was taking one large video so I didn't even get any pictures for myself um, but like I said we're gonna try to work on that maybe I'll get a camera if I absolutely have to to try to continue this it really sucks that this happened on the second episode um, but I'm gonna try to keep going with it and we'll see what we can do the wolf spider update she ate her sack so obviously we will not be getting babies from that which is kind of okay with me because I'm not trying to breed at the moment so a bunch of tiny little itty bitty spiders that I have to care for which I would eventually release in general I do plan on releasing all my true spiders uh, before they pass so that they can have a chance to you know further their own species um, but yeah I'll end up doing videos about my feeder colonies you know obviously feeding videos and uh, new additions will come every now and then like I've said I have a couple coming next uh, this Wednesday this upcoming Wednesday so we will just see how far this goes and uh, yeah I'll just keep posting videos like I said it's I do it because I want to why not you know I enjoy doing it 
maybe some other people enjoy watching or maybe have questions and I'm able to help them. It's not it's not something that I'm super uh, it's something I want to do so yeah just just because I don't I, I, I don't know at the same time I don't really feel like it needs explanation but um, like I said most some people can find it boring but it is just me caring for my animals and sharing with you guys what I do on a regular basis and how I do it um, maybe we'll get the video when the yeah we'll definitely go ahead and get a video when uh, the pumpkin patch the Hapalopus uh, Columbia species large comes in and I will do my best to get a little rehouse video on that depending on what they come in um, we'll just have to see and yeah I guess I think that's good oh uh, thanks to my subscribers uh, I really appreciate the support and everything uh, thanks again to Will and Angie for the awesome light fixture it is really helping to get good shots even though I don't have them anymore but it's helping me to get really good shots good video um, and all in all I think it just looks better because I sit in front of this every day this everything right here is just right in front of my couch so this is my view on a daily basis um, and it's a lot more appealing to me as well so thanks again and We'll see you next time.